Hello and welcome back to Claire. So, I'm in the same room as before, uh, where the evil man is outside. He's very evil and I need to, like, pace it, peg it. Ooh. What a swine. Shove off yogurt, man. I'm guessing we have to, like, turn the alarms off? And tell the kid we've turned them off. Let's do that. Yo, alarm's all gone quiet. I turned the alarm off. I can leave now? Yeah. Do you want to come with me? Yeah. Yeah, let's go. I'm right behind you. Yeah. Uh, I turned the alarms off. Can I? Yeah, yeah. We've done. Ugh. Thank you. Uh, alright. Uh, peace, I guess. Good. I helped a person. I didn't help the lady with the books, though, because I only found two. Dolt. Okay, so I'm still guessing I'm going to have to absolutely peg it out and then go down the hallway. And go down this way? Oh no, it's blocked. So back up. Ooh, a butterfly. It's back in the bathroom. Is there any other way to go? Okay, maybe we start backtracking, perhaps? Anything in here? Nope, just pure terror. Let's leave. Okay, we'll leave the satanic bathroom alone, I guess. So what's our current goal here? It's kind of confusing. Have a look around here, I suppose. Nope. Ah, we need to get over there. Piss only knows how we get that way. Well, there was a save point back this way, which I found, luckily. I'll show you. After doing 20 minutes of re-walking. See? Let's go quickly jump in here and save it again. Yoink. Tar. Sticky keys will not turn off, by the way. I'm actually sticky keys myself while running away from some big baddies. It's very irritating. So that's here. Where's the other way lead? Is it blocked? Oh, no. This leads back to there. Knobs melted. Okay, so we have to go that way then. This is the only way that makes sense at the moment. I'm not entirely sure where to go. Okay. There might be some baddies or whatever the game passes for baddies in here. <laughs> Definitely evil. Alright, just jump over. Hoop. <laughs> Alright, let's just get a bit of a breathing room. So we're here. Is there anything in this room? Oh! That place. Okay. I was like, ouch, the handle is too hot. Just like the fire still going on. Seems suspicious to me. Where are we now? In this in this room here. Okay. Hello! Anyone spooky alive? <laughs> Back in this corridor? The knobs melted. Lol. Well, there ain't anywhere to go here. Aha! The melted shot. Mm, yeah, don't keep thinking about it. It's blocked from the other side. Of course it is! It's Silent School! Home of the evil wankers and obscure locked doors. Nope! Okay, so what? No, oh, it's bog. Item. Maxwell battery. Well, that ain't a sodding book, is it? I don't know where that book's supposed to be. Destroy class. Where the hell am I now then? Oh, I'm on the bottom floor. Maybe there's some bits of rooms I haven't explored yet. Look, but look at the left side of the map over here. Would be my guess. But piss on your nose. <laughs> Shit. And jump. Oh. 
Oh, Jesus. This guy's kind of relentless. Let's keep moving, I guess. It's the only problem when you can't defend yourself, you have to, you have to keep moving a bit. There we go. Alright, where are we? Oh, probably roughly where we want to be. It's handy. Somewhere in here. Oh, we can hide in here, okay. An empty classroom. Oh, there's a man in here. Hello, man. The whole room is charred. What are you doing here? Sniffle. You shouldn't be here. What? Why? Because it's not safe. Then let's get out of here. My name is Claire. I don't care what your name is. Well, if it's not safe in here, then we should leave. No, it's not safe in here because of me. What? Why? It's all my fault. I hated those kids, but I didn't want this. I just wanted to scare them. The fire. You caused it? Yes. I thought if I could scare them enough, they'd be interested in chemistry. What? It was an accident? Oh. It was an accident, then why are they tormenting me? I don't know, maybe because you burn them all alive? Blaming me from the shadows. Who is blaming you? Them! Can't you see them? You have to see them. We should get you out of here. Don't come near me. Did you hear that? Hear yeah, what? Guilty. What do you want from me? It was your fault. You're sorry for what you did, right? It wasn't your fault. If he's sorry for what he did, I suppose this is where you get a choice. You forgive the man, you torment the man, or... Well, if he's sorry... I'm not coming with you. No, I'm not ready. Her, you sent her, didn't you? She's your executioner, then. Uh, no. I won't let you. They were all horrible, and you're just like them. Wait. I told you, you shouldn't be here. Huh. Alright, well, guess I didn't save that guy. Guess I'm supposed to just tell him it wasn't his fault. Should have been a lie, but there you go. Onwards, I suppose. The knob's melted. <laughs> Long. Looks terrifying. Nothing that way. Okay, it's the right way to get him. My inventory is full. Not if I drink some happy sun curry, won't be. Nice. The handle is too hot. These dudes aren't doing any good for my sanity. Uh. I imagine that's not helping things. Anxious. Yeah, no bloody right. Okay. Yeah, science. Is this the chemistry classroom where the fire started, perhaps? Hello? Anyone spooky? Ask if he's okay. Alright. Found a max cell battery. Found a node. Mm -mm. Oops. Nodes. Is it guilty? Oh no, it's not that one. Memories. There's a little kid on the field throwing baseballs. He didn't stop throwing, he was a machine. But as I got closer, I could see him crying. For the first time he stopped to make eye contact with me, and he bent back to throwing. I heard him whimper, why can't I get this? Oh, no good asking me. Guess we'll leave Mr. Chemistry to it. Where we're supposed to go, where we were, who knows? Found a note. Well, this doesn't seem the best place to read it. Let's read it in here. Little boy. I was trying to help. I thought I could help. I could see him give up and then he shattered before my eyes. Alright. Sounds a bit weird. Blocks. There's too many of those things. piss is going on here. Why are all these dudes here, anyway? Oh, save room. Yoink. 
Ah. This seems to restore your sanity to full, which is weird. I guess Claire really likes gummy bears, I think. Okay. My inventory is full. Good and calm. Let's take some crappy soda then. Hard candy! Makes you immune to panic. Which I'll probably need for the next section, to be honest. Okay, let's look at where we are. We're right on the outside part, I guess? Hmm. Let's see what we can do out here, I suppose. Well, that's not good. Shit. Can I run past him? I have to, I think. Yeah, bollocks to you, mate. Let's see what you're regarding. Before my feeble mind gives up. Hello? Latest, mate. Uh oh. Horrified. Candy! Take some candy then. Jesus, what the hell is going on with these places? It's like this big sanity marathon around here. Right. Let's do this. I can feel the tide. What the? All these assholes are ruining my sanity. Ebb and flow. Oh, now I can't get any light out. Snap out of it, Claire. Yeah, pretty good idea. Before we lose our shit. There's some twitches. Oh nice, a spooky tree man, a yogurt. Yoink, Claire says. Mm. What is this? It's time, Claire. Time for what? You've had your time. What's left is no longer your concern. I don't understand. That makes two of us, Claire. Well, it's time you did. Shit, Claire's been hitting the dodgy acid again. They tell you not to take the brown acid, yeah? Ooh, it's like a butterfly tree. Hello, Claire. What? What is this? Where am I? You are here. Oh, is this the pronoun game? Alright. Let's find out what we're talking about. What kind of answer is that? Where is here? That depends on you. What do you mean? Who are you? You don't recognise me? What, a big tree made out of yoghurt? I hope it's not too late for that dance. No. No! You don't get to say that. Wait, the tree's your dad? Ugh. Claire, I... No, Dad! You abandoned me! I needed you and you abandoned me! What kind of person forces a little girl to take care of her brain-dead mother? You robbed me of my childhood. Claire, God knows I have a lot to answer for, but I didn't abandon you. Not on purpose. Oh, really? I'd love to hear your excuse. You don't remember, do you? Remember what? I was taken from you. So what, you're dead? Yes. Ha, huh, you actually expect me to believe that? To be honest, I don't know what to expect. But I'm a talking tree made out of yogurt, so who knows. Well, there isn't much of a difference in your parenting style, dead or alive. <laughs> Dad, sick burn, has to apply bandage. <laughs> I know. Oh. You need to know that I loved you and your brother more than anything in the world. You? Claire, let me finish! Oh! I thought I could shield you from my demons. But when I missed your dance, I realised that was impossible. I saw what I did to you. No father should hurt his daughter like that. I decided to get clean, but it was too late. There was other collateral damage. What do you want from me, Dad? I don't know. You have no idea how badly I just want to hug you and beg for your forgiveness, but I can't because I'm a tree made out of yogurt. Well, I don't think, realistically, I just want you to know that given another chance, I would have been a good father. Me and Ethan were the only things that should have ever mattered. It took me a long time to figure that out. But wandering here for a long time can clear your head, if you let it. What do you mean, a long time? My journey here took longer than yours. Where is here? Like I said before, it depends on you. Look, Tree Dad, you're being very cryptic. I can't make you remember, Claire. Things don't make sense. If you're dead, then how come I'm just finding out? Someone would have said something. You're right. Keep thinking. I'm trying. You said there was other collateral damage. Claire, your hand. It's bleeding. How did I cut it? Wait. I woke up the bandage in the nurse's office, but I don't remember cutting it. 
Ethan. The picture. Dad, Ethan. Ethan is dead too, isn't he? Yes. Dad, how did you and Ethan die? I'm guessing a car crash when he was drunk, perhaps, but... Like I said, my demons affected more than just my children. No! Claire, now it's time to ask yourself, do I deserve to be here? What did I do? I don't know. Only you know the truth. Time to break down the barriers. I don't know what I did! I want to remember, I swear. You don't deserve to be here. You would do anything to get out. That's not true. But it is. I am... What the... <laughs> I am you, and you would know better than us. Weird. No, oh, go away. Leave us stop. I'm dead. She doesn't care anymore, apparently. About anything. Unfamiliar voice. Find where it's coming from. Well, where's my dog gone? I don't care. Just let me sleep. Claire. Leave me alone. Why am I standing up? Find out where it's coming from. Wait. Ooh, a save point. Let's make the most of that. I want my dog back. Damn it. I'm in the apartment. Guess we're heading home then. Creepy guys again. Alright, well, here's a good place to stop. We've got a brand new map. There's some Lego on the floor and weird shit has happened. Weirder than usual. So, I hope you enjoyed the set. And next time, we'll progress through the apartment and find out what the piss is going on, I hope. So, until then, guys. Thanks for watching.